Hey Maximizers, welcome back to my channel and welcome to episode 4 in the Coupon for Beginner series. If you are new here, welcome. If you're new to couponing, you have found the right place. This is episode 4 in the series. I will be sure to link um, episodes 1, 2, and 3 so that you can catch up because this episode will build on what we learned in episodes 1, 2, and 3. This episode is dedicated to matching deals and the basics of couponing. So this video will be a little lengthy, but it's going to be very detailed on basically how to coupon at any store, how to match deals, and how to basically maximize your dollars and get the most savings. So I'm going to show you how to match the deals. All right, so we are at the point now where we know where to get coupons. We know the different types of coupons and we know how to organize our coupons. Now we are going to learn how to use them and how to match deals efficiently. Now there's multiple stores all over the country that accept coupons. I am in Florida and I also lived in Maryland so I've couponed in those two states and I know the stores that are in that area. But these techniques, this basic skill that I'm going to teach you all it's going to work at any store that accepts coupons. Any store that has a sale, you can apply this to as long as they accept manufacturer coupons, okay? Um, so this, like I said, this video will be a little long, but I'm trying to be as detailed as possible to help all of my beginners, okay? As always, there's a cheat sheet linked down below with everything that we're going to go over here with places for you to take notes, make comments, make questions. So you can comment the questions down below and I'll be sure to get back to you and answer those. Um, so make sure you print out that cheat sheet so you can have something to take notes on and follow along with, all right? Um, okay, so we're at the point now where we have our coupon inserts um, and we have our ads. So I have a lot of notes here, so I'll be looking down to grab the coupons and grab the notes and also to switch my camera angle around so that I can show you guys what I'm looking at downwards as far as um, the coupons as well as the actual um, ads. So I'm just going to hold one up. The four stores we're going to go over is CVS. We're going to go through a CVS ad and match some deals. We're going to go over Walgreens. Now, I do know that CVS and Walgreens are stores that are like nationwide. So most likely you'll have one in your state, whether it's near or far will depend. But those are stores that I know that most everyone has. We are also going to go through a Target ad. And we're going to go through a Dollar General ad. But again, the techniques that I'll be teaching you all, you can use at any of your local stores. Um, in Baltimore, I really miss going to like Stop and Shop because they have phenomenal deals. And shoppers, they have great deals. So if you have like a small store that's regional, we're in Florida, we have Publix. I'm not going to go over Publix, but that's a store that's like in Florida and Georgia and I think South Carolina. Um, but that's a regional store, right? And then we have the national stores like CVS, Target. Walgreens, those are stores that are everywhere, and then Walmart. Walmart's probably the easiest store to keep on at because it's straight up. Um, but we'll get into that later. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is gather all of your ads. So I have all of my ads. I got my newspaper. I went over where to get the coupons in episode one. Um, but I got my newspaper. I'm using a newspaper that is from September 9th. Same one I used in all my beginner series so far. Um, but I have all my ads, and I took out all of my inserts so there's four inserts that came we had two retail me nots and two smart sources now um, for this purposes we're gonna focus just on having paper coupons and I think I have some printable coupons we will talk about digitals but I'm not gonna show digitals because this video would be super long but we went over the different types of coupons I believe that was in episode two so I will link it right here so if you want to go back and learn about the different types please go check out episode two it's 2018 and no matter where you are in the United States, there is a couponer that is on YouTube or Instagram showing you the deals. So you can see these deals as early as a week before they come out when the ad previews go. So literally you go to Google and you type in whatever store you're looking for. So Dollar General ad preview and it'll pop up. So you can start preparing for your deals at least a week in advance. Or you can wait for the couponers to post ad previews. I also always post top deals at CVS and Walgreens. Um, you can wait until those are posted from a couponer. And you can literally check the deals. Me personally, I link um, a printable breakdown with literally all the deals. 
and all the coupons and where they come from for CVS and Walgreens. Um, let me show you guys that because I personally love it and I use my own breakdowns. Um, so let me show you that. Okay, so I'm gonna show you my printable breakdown. And at this point right now, I only do this for Walgreens and CVS. I may be incorporating other stores that I plan to shop at every week with the printable breakdown, but this has been a lifesaver for me personally as a couponer because it's very organized, okay? Okay, don't mind my chicken scratch. I didn't have time to print out a fresh one. But this is my printable breakdown from this week from Walgreens. So as you can see, I put the item, I put the price, the coupon, where the coupon is located, the store reward, we're at Walgreens. So they give back um, points and they give back register rewards, rebate apps, the store out of pocket. So what you'll pay at the register and then what's your final price for the product or products after you get back your rebate apps and your store reward. So this printable breakdown I put out about two to three days before the deals actually start. Okay, lots of couponers have something very similar or they go over the ad preview with you, okay? So you will have ample opportunity to actually look at the ad before Sunday. If you're waiting till Sunday to grab your newspapers, then this is what you need to do. When you are couponing, you get your ad. And the first thing I do is I look at an ad about five times, like the first time I get it. The first time I'm just literally looking to see what's on sale and um, I'll circle things that I want to possibly do, okay? So at Dollar General on this week, this was their ad. You see when the prices are effective. And I'm gonna go through this at first. So you see all of these things. So I go through the ad and I'm just scanning to see what we have. Once you've been couponing for a few weeks and you cut out all your coupons, you will kind of know which coupons you have in your arsenal. And then the ad, will literally tell you where coupons are, okay? This is the digital side of Dollar General, so they're literally telling you, the Tide, the Tide Pods simply are on sale for $2.95, there's a $2 digital coupon, you'll pay 95 cents for it. So it's telling you there's a coupon and it's telling you that it's digital for Dollar General, okay? So they do have to battle for you at Dollar General. But anyway, so the first time we're literally skimming the ad just to see what we have. If any of these things are on your wants or need list, right? So we're going to scroll up just to see what's there. And I did cut it off a little bit. I accidentally ripped it, so I apologize. Um, and then we're going to just look to see what they have, what's on sale. All right. Also, in this week, I showed you that we got four inserts. We got two Retail Me Nots, one. Two, and then we got two smart source one and two okay so the second thing I would do is after I look through my first ad I'll look through all my coupons or I'll look through all the coupons first and then I'll look through my ads but nowadays with um, coupon ad previews I kind of know what's going on because you can go as I showed you um, I believe it was in episode one where to find coupons you can literally look at a coupon um, preview and you'll see which coupons are coming out. But I literally like to thumb through these just maybe once or twice to see, right, what coupons are in here for this week. Because we are trying to get the most for our money. So we want to see what coupons we have. And we are literally going to match our coupons to the sale price. We only want to buy stuff that is on sale. You don't want to buy something that's full price just because you have a coupon. Unless it's something you desperately need. Look, I know we saw this in the ad, right? So that's, we want to buy what's on sale and use a coupon to get it at the best price possible. So I hope this makes sense to you all. You go through the ad and then you literally go through your coupons to see what you have, all right? So then I went through that one. I'm not going to go through all four because it will make this video long, okay? So, we go through the coupons, we look at the ad. So, now this time, I'm going back to look through to see, hmm, what do I have a coupon for and if it's a good deal? Now, this one is pretty easy, right? Because it's a digital coupon. As long as you download the Dollar General app, it tells you right here what to do. Download the Dollar General app and you can add this coupon, right? So, this is a deal... I definitely want to look into. 
This deal is also one I want to look to. 52 ounces of dish soap for a dollar. We're going to circle it. Then we got razors, a 10 pack of razors for a dollar. We're going to look at that one, right? I prepared for this. So I have some coupons and some deals that I want to focus on. So let me show you guys those. The first deal that I want to point out that I have a coupon for, a paper coupon, right? Yeah. Is going to be this Kellogg cereal. They are three for $6. That's a great price. Because that means they're $2 each. The ad says you have to purchase three. So if you purchase one, it's going to be at regular price. If you purchase two, it's going to be at regular price. If you purchase four, it's going to be at regular price. You have to purchase in groups of three. The ad dictates it. So, three for six. And we have a $1 off three coupon. It says on any three Kellogg cereal, 8.7 ounces or larger, any flavor, any mix or match. So we're going to look at what the deal dictates. And it says 10.2 ounces, 10.5 ounces. So that's above 8.7, right? So we can use this coupon. We'll get three boxes of cereal for $5. That's going to make each cereal, each that's going to make each box of cereal just $1.66. If you need cereal, this would definitely be a good deal for you to do. Three for six, $1.66 each. Now, one thing I talk about in my CVS videos, my Walgreens videos, is I always compare my prices to Walmart. Because Walmart is typically the cheapest place, and I use that kind of as my threshold. I will be having a video coming up soon of stockpile prices or what's the best deal ideally. But of course, that's going to be up to you and how much you're willing to pay for each item. But I'll be coming out with, you know, a guide of some sort to let you know, like, if it's a good deal or not. But check your, your cheapest store in your area. Mine is Walmart. Compare the price to see if it's a good deal. Okay? So me, I'm buying this cereal. But I hope you guys get the concept. You look at the ad. You find the coupon. You can also use a coupon database. If you saw this and you were like, oh man, I'd love to do this deal. Let me see if there's a coupon. Check out the coupon database. That is also in episodes one and episodes two on how to use the coupon database. Okay? So that's the first deal I want to point out. Now, while we're on this page, let's go to the digitals. I kind of went over this already. But Dollar General shows you that there's a $2 digital coupon. So all you need to do is download the Dollar General app. Add this coupon to your um, list. You put your phone number at the register. The $2 coupon will come off and you'll pay $0.95 cents at the register for 13 count of Tide Pods. That is phenomenal. Okay? The second deal, the Palm Olive. It's regular price of $3. There's a $2 digital coupon. So again, you put your phone number in at the register. You'll pay $1 for 52 ounces. Okay? That is a great deal. The 52 ounces at Walmart is $2.78. So this is $1.78 cheaper than Walmart. This is a great deal. Run and get it. Okay? If you are a beginner, this is also a good deal. There are times where we can get the big razors for free because we sometimes get a $3 coupon. But if you're a beginner and you need razors... One dollar for ten razors is phenomenal. So I would suggest, you know, you clip it to your card and you clip it to your account, put your phone number in, and bam, you'll pay one dollar for razors. So right here alone, two dollars and ninety-five cents, you'll get a pack of razors, some dish soap, and some laundry detergent. Right? And if you add in your cereal, you're at seven dollars and ninety-five cents, and you're gonna have three, four, five, six items. Three, four, five, six items. For $7.95. So that is a great price. Okay? So I hope you are getting the concept. Very basic. Look at the ad. Match the deals. Let's go through the rest of this rather quickly since I went over the basics. I'm just going to go to the back of the ad. Because getting um, laundry products that are name brand for a cheap price is great. So you can see here that the Gain Fabric Softener, the Gain Flings, the Fireworks, they are on sale for $4.50. They also tell you that there's a digital coupon for $2 off. But there's also paper coupons. 
two dollar off as you can see it's a limited one two dollars off this is liquid or powder this is game fling and this is off fabric enhancer so you can use this on dryer seats the fireworks or the softener okay so i just want to show you guys that you go through the ad and look for what's on sale and match your coupons let's go to the next store i hope this makes sense next let's go over target so same thing i will go through the ad and look at whatever's on sale and then i will match the deals okay um there's only a couple things i want to point out here but i hope you get get the concept right you look through the ad see what's on sale you match the deals now this is a great promo free five dollar gift card when you spend fifteen dollars on yogurt now i did this deal in its in its week when it was live and um it came out to be a great deal for me um because i spent fifteen dollars and i got a five dollar gift card but um, there's coupons that I don't have right now to show you, um, that made it such a good deal. But what I will show you is this, um, these coupons are printable and then they also come out in the inserts 50 cents off five when you buy five cups, which doesn't seem like a lot, but these cups are between like 65 and 75 cents for each one. Um, so it is a little bit of savings, but any savings is good savings, especially when you are getting the $5 gift card which already cuts down $5 off your price, um, of what your final cost will be after you get your reward, okay? So there was also go Get coupons when I did this, and there was also $1 off the eight pack of YoPlay. So um, it was this coupon, but it was $1 off the eight pack. So I used one of these, and I used one of the $1 off the eight packs, and I bought two go -Gurts. Um so I'll insert a picture if I have it. So this is a good breakfast deal. The Quaker products, select Quaker products, so on sale for $2.50, okay? There is a $1 off two Quaker products coupon that came out in one of the inserts. It's a manufacturer coupon. It says manufacturer at the top. When you buy two Quaker products, and it looks like and your mom is on here, right? And, and your mom is on here. So you can grab two Quaker products, and your total will be four dollars after you use this coupon. 250 plus 250, five dollars. So it's two for five. Use this coupon, it'll make each product just two dollars each. Okay. Target's also great because if you have the red card, you can get five percent off. So that's additional savings. And then you can also use Cartwheel offers at Target. Um, I will be doing a whole video on Target, so I don't want to get into too much detail, but there's a lot of ways to save at Target, but very basic. We see a deal, a sale, we grab a coupon, we pair it up. That's how we save money. It's that simple, my friends. It's that simple. There's no magic. There's no tricks. Um, literally, look up the deals, match them with coupons, and save money. The select Nutri-Grain and Nature Valley and Fiber One Bars are two for $5. We sometimes get a $1 off two coupon or we get a $0.50 cents off two. Nature Valley's. 50 cents off two, right? So it would make, um, if we got two boxes of the Nature Valleys, it will make them two for $4.50. There's also sometimes rebates back from Saving Star, Checkout 51, um, another level. I'll go over all those rebate apps as well um, later in the beginner series. But there's a lot of ways to save. But very basically, you see a sale, you find the coupon, you match it up, and that's how you save, okay? This isn't the best, best deal, but if you're a beginner and this is something that you were going to pay full price for anyway, use the coupon. It's on sale. It's not regular price. Use the coupon, okay? So let's move on to one of my favorite stores. Walgreens and CVS. So we're gonna do Walgreens up first and I have some notes, so hold on one second. And with Walgreens and CVS, literally in their ads, they tell you if there's a coupon out. So I'm just gonna show you one and then I'll get into more detail. Right here for the Purex, it tells you if you have a Walgreens card, it's $1.99. If you use the 50 cents off coupon that's in most Sunday papers, it'll be $1.49 and you can get the Purex or you can get the Purex crystals. So you know in the inserts that came out the same week as this, which is September 9th through the 15th, 
there should be a Purex coupon. Now I have some notes here. And what I'm also gonna do with you all is I'm gonna go through the insert so we can find the coupons to match these deals. So I have one, two, three deals for us to match at, um, four deals for us to match at Walgreens, okay? The first one is that Purex. What I did was, I saw that the Purex was on sale. I saw that there was a 50 cents off coupon. And I was like, okay, when I look through my inserts, I want to look for that Purex coupon. The second deal I want to go over with you guys is going to be on the Blue Diamond Almonds. They are $5.99 if you have a Walgreens card. If you use a $1 off coupon that's in most Sunday's papers, you're going to pay $4.99. This is a giant bag of almonds, 16 ounces. This is a great healthy snack, okay? An alternative to candy. Okay, the next deals I want to point out to you guys is on the Garnier. They are two for seven. The ad literally says there's a $2 off coupon in most Sunday papers. So they're going to come out to two for five. The Garnier Fructis is on sale two for seven. But they're saying if you use that $3 off two coupon that comes out, it's going to make them two for four. So I love the ad because it literally shows you exactly um, if there's a coupon for the item, if it's on sale, okay? And then the other thing I want to show you is going to be on some uh, paper products. So let's get to that one. Scott Comfort Plus is $9. This $2 right here means less coupon online or in store. Walgreens has a booklet where at the front of their store they leave it and it has coupons in it. Anybody can pick up the booklet, and the booklet has coupons in it, store coupons. And if you watched um, the different types of coupons video, which is episode two, you will learn that you can use one manufactured coupon, one store coupon per item. So the coupon rules are you can use one manufacturer coupon and one store coupon per item. So as you can see, you're going to use that $2 off coupon in the booklet. Then there's a 50 cents coupon in most Sunday papers. You're going to end up paying $6.50 for 24 rolls of toilet paper, which is a great price. So if you need toilet paper, this would definitely be a good deal for you to do if this was the current week. Okay? A reminder, this is not the current week. This is from September 9th. But that's the next deal. So now, I looked through the ad. I told you guys, oh, I lied. I want to bring up the Sparkle. The Sparkle paper towels are on sale for $5.00. They say that there's a $1 off coupon in most Sunday papers, which is going to make six rolls just $4. That's another great price if you need paper towels, okay? So now we're going to go through the inserts. And if you need to find out which insert the coupons are in, you can either A, look through each one because you have all four of them, or B, you can go to the coupon database. It's going to be linked in the description box. I use two databases. I use hip to save and I also use Southern Savers. You can use either one. You type in the brand that you're looking for, or you can even type in toilet paper. If there's coupons available, whether they're printable, digital, or um, in the inserts, the database will tell you exactly where the coupons are located. And I go over that in episode one, where to find coupons, okay? So here's a Blue Diamond Almond coupon, right? One, $1 off on any 10 ounce or larger bag. The bags in here are 16 ounces, so use this and you'll pay $4.99 at the register, okay? Next one, as I was going to tell you guys, I prepared and I wrote down where everything was located. I literally went through each insert to find the coupons because these coupons are old. The database is not accurate because these papers are like two months old at this point. Okay, so in the Retail Me Not number two, and I labeled it number one and number two, we're going to find the Purex and we're going to find the Garnier. First page, a Garnier Fructis coupon. And let me get the ad because I want to be very clear. Um, I hope this is clear and I hope you guys understand it. That is my goal to help all of my beginner couponers. Okay, so here's the Garnier Fructis. $3 off any two Garnier Fructis shampoo, conditioner, treatment, or styler. Here it is. Garnier Fructis hair care. Right now in this picture, we see a styler and we see... A shampoo so you can get any variety um shampoo conditioner or styler use that three dollar off coupon it's gonna make them just two dollars each 
that's a good deal. Not the best deal. We can get it cheaper. But if you're a beginner, you're just starting. That is definitely a good deal to start off with. Okay? A good price. Here is the Garnier Hope Blends. It's $2 off any one. The deal is two for seven. But if you look at the coupon in red, one coupon per purchase. No more than one identical coupon per household per day. So the coupon dictates that we can only use one. So if we go back to our ad, they're on sale two for seven. We can use one coupon. It will make them two for $5. This is also a decent deal. If you are a newbie, if you're a beginner, and it's your first week couponing, that would definitely be a deal that you could try. The Purex. Let's search for the Purex, okay? So this is literally what I do. I just go through because I know it's in here somewhere per the coupon database, which right now the fake database is actually me. It's in here. And voila, la, here we are. We have 50 cents off any Purex liquid powder or detergent, any size. We have $1 off any Purex liquid detergent, 128 ounces or larger. And then we have 50 cents off any Purex crystals in Boost Washer. Okay? So, there's 50 cents for the crystals. And then there's 50 cents for the Purex. Because the Purex that's on sale, the liquid, is 43.5 ounces or 50 ounces. So, we can only use the 50 cents off coupon. So you cut out this coupon, use it at the register, and you'll pay $1.49 for your Purex. Now, these coupons, the Purex coupons, are also a limit of one coupon per purchase, limit of one identical coupon per shopping trip. So you can only do these one day at a time. So you can grab one of each, though. You can grab one Crystals, one Purex liquid. You pay $3 and get two products. Well, around $2.99, okay? So I hope we all understand. Grab the ad, look what's on sale, match it with the coupon, okay? And let's keep going because now we need to look at the Scott's coupon, which is in the smart source that I labeled smart source number one. So let's All go. right, here's the insert that I labeled smart source number one. Let's go so we can find the Scott's toilet paper coupon, okay? All right, here it is. We have... 50 cents off Cottonelle, Scott tissue, it has to be four rolls or more. 50 cents off Scott paper towels, it has to be six rolls or more. And then there's other, we got Viva, we got Kleenex, um, Viva pop-ups. So here is a 50 cents off coupon. So we can go back to our ad and let's find our toilet paper. It's right here. Here's our ad and there's our coupon, okay? Find the sale match the coupon it's just that simple this technique can be used literally at any store that accepts coupons so you get your weekly ads you look in the ad to see what's on sale and then you match it up with whatever coupons you have from that current week or previous coupons that you had from previous weeks that's why it is in my humble opinion to get inserts each week even if you just get two get a minimum of two each week of course, look at the insert preview to make sure that you're getting coupons because there is a few weeks throughout the year where there's no coupon inserts. In okay, the so let's go over CVS, which is probably my number one favorite store. CVS is my number one favorite store to keep on at because of the extra bucks that we can get back and how, you know, you can actually get stuff for legit for free. Um, so here's CVS. They have some awesome deals. This week they had, when you spend $30 on participating beauty products, they were giving out this beauty bag that was valued at over $14.99. So over a $15 value um, on products. It had eight pieces to it, including the bag. So I thought that was a sweet deal. CVS, also, I'll be doing a full video on CVS, so don't you worry your little heart out because there's so much to learn, so much to teach, and there's so much to do at CVS. I really love it. That's why it's my favorite store. But anyways, they have these deals. If you haven't shopped at CVS before, the rewards at CVS are called Extra Bucks. Um, it's like CVS money. They have these deals where it's like spend 10, spend 20, spend 30, and you'll earn X amount of Extra Bucks, okay? So... You're going to go through this ad, and you're going to see what is on sale, what's hot, right? And then you're going to match your coupons to what's on sale and what's hot, okay? So I'm not going to go through everything, so let me show you what we're going to go over. 
we're going to go over this Colgate deal. The Colgate toothpaste is going to be on sale for $3.50. There is a $1 manufacturer coupon in most Sunday papers. As you can see, it tells you. I believe it's in smart source number one. And then you're going to get a $2.50 instant coupon. All you have to do is be an extra care card holder as of September 2nd. And this coupon will print for you at the red box. So when you go to the red box at CVS, you put your phone number in, coupons print out. So again, you're going to use the $2.50 instant coupon. It's going to make this free. You're going to pay $0.00 at the register and walk out with a Colgate toothpaste. Let's find the coupon. So you literally look up the sale and match the coupon. And again, I'm showing you this in real time because I want you guys to see it. I want you to know that it's it's not hard. It does take a little bit time of time. It does take a little bit of getting used to. Um, but it's so simple. And for me, honestly, if we're being very, very honest, I will put in the time to save money. I will spend hours of my time doing this to save money because it's that important to me. And staying on budget and reaching my financial goals and life goals is important to me. So investing a few hours a week to save big at the store is worth it to me. All right. Okay, and here's the Colgate coupon you would use with that Colgate deal, the $1 off one coupon. You'd use that with the instant coupon to get your free toothpaste. Now, let's move on. Another deal we can check out is the CoverGirl. As you can see, it's letter C up here. And if you go down, letter C, buy two, get a $5 extra buck. It does exclude the Katie Cat. So you can grab any two CoverGirl um, cosmetics and you'll be able to get a $5 extra buck. CoverGirl typically gives us some good coupons, so let's go check them out. Okay, and here are the CoverGirl coupons. I was finally able to locate them. $2 off any CoverGirl face product, eye product, or lip product. So if you were going to do this CoverGirl deal at CVS, you could find two products that you really want to buy, and then you can use one of these coupons on them, okay? Now, let's go over a freebie deal. Something that you can get absolutely free along with your toothpaste at CVS. This is probably one of my favorite deals to date. These one-a-day vitamins were on sale for $4, okay? There's a $4 manufacturer coupon. It makes them absolutely free. You walk in the store with a piece of paper called a coupon, and you walk out with products for free. I went to a lot of different CVSs that day, and I got a lot of vitamins because I don't like to clear the shelf as a couponer. I like to get a max of four items and then go to another store. I don't like to clear the shelves. I like to save some for someone else because I would hate to want to get a deal and then there's nothing left because one person got it all. So let me show you the coupon that made this a freebie. And I can't wait for this deal to come back. Here is the coupon, the Nature Made. So you can use um, the kids and you can use the men or women's. The coupon dictates that it's a limit of four of the exact same coupons per household per day. Um, so you can only use four of the kids and you can only use four of the men or women's. Um, so I went and I got a two and two, went to the next door, got two or two, so on and so forth. I did that for a couple days um, at a couple different stores in order to get a lot of free vitamins now we're stocked up on vitamins um for about a year which is great um so that is pretty much it as far as me showing you the ads and what to um do and how to do it okay maximizers i know that was a lot it could seem a little overwhelming you know flipping through all these inserts blah 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 there's usually only about two inserts each week and then uh, once a month, the Procter & Gamble inserts come out, the P&G. Um, so some weeks you get three with a one Retail Me Not, one Smart Source, one Procter & Gamble. Sometimes you get a lot. So I like weeks when there's more coupons because that means that it's more deals, more options. So let's recap the basics of couponing. How to catch a deal. Get your ad and you skim it. You look at it. You see what's on sale. You see what's hot. You kind of like see what you need. You see what you want. See what you're interested in trying, okay? Then you go through your inserts for the current week, right? I personally, because I'm a couponer and I love this so much, 
I look through each insert to see what's in there. Now, because um, I'm sharing all of my deals with you all and I'm trying to help people, I do look, look at these early. I look at these about... If the coupons come out on Sunday, I'm looking at them on maybe Wednesday to see which coupons are coming out on Sunday. So I know what to expect. Look through my inserts um, every Sunday as soon as I get them to see what's there. Because sometimes there's things in there that was not in the preview. Sometimes the preview will show you that the coupon is going to be $1 and it's $0.50. Cents, or it shows you that the coupon is going to be $0.50 cents and it turns out to be $1 to make your deal even better. Okay? So when you get your inserts on Sunday... Go through them. Take a few minutes. Go through them. This whole process on a Sunday when you get your newspapers or Saturday. Some people get their newspapers on Saturdays. When you get your newspapers, right? You pull out your ads and you look at your coupons. Shouldn't take you more than about one hour to look at each ad, look at your coupons, cut out what you need. Because it's 2018 and there's YouTubers, um, there's Instagrammers who are couponers and they're doing their very best to help you get the best deals. All you have to do is watch some videos, look at some Instagram couponers and you'll kind of see what the best deals are. So when you get your stuff on Sunday or on Saturday, you kind of already have an idea of what you want. If you subscribe to my channel, right, and you want to shop at CVS or Walgreens, I have this ready for you. On a bad week, it's ready on Saturday for Sunday. On a good week, I have these up on Thursday or Friday. Thursday for Walgreens, Friday for CVS. I have these up and ready for you. So literally, when you, you can print this out, and then when you get your inserts, you're like, oh, she said this is on sale. For instance, something that we talked about in this thing, the Blue Diamond Almonds. They're on sale this week, which is um, November 11th at Walgreens. Same price that I showed you in the video. $5.99 and there's a $1 off one coupon. So if you print this out on Thursday and you're like, oh, like me, I'll put checks and X's next to what I'm doing, right? What I'm doing is a check, what I'm not doing is an X. Um, then I'm like, oh, I need to find my almond coupon because I want to do that, right? There's Pantene on this, whatever it is, right? My breakdown, another coupon is breakdown. Um, Dollar General, they have like Saturday only coupons where you can pair it with a store coupon of five off 25 a lot of people will post like if you're gonna go to dollar general this week you should get this this and this and use this this and this coupon you can print these things out you can screenshot them on your phone so when you get your coupons all you have to do is be like okay these are the deals that i want to do cut them out if you also want to do it old school and you don't watch anybody on youtube you don't look at anybody on instagram how would you know if you don't watch YouTube? Because you wouldn't be watching me right now. But anyways, if you don't want to look at anybody else, you want to do it on your own, that's perfectly fine. Or if you have a store that it's not heavily um, populated, it's like maybe, I don't want to say mom and pop, but it's small to your area, to your state, to your region. Um, literally, like I told you, this works anywhere. You look at your ad, you see what's on sale, and then you use the coupon database, like I told you, either hip to save or southernsavers.com. I'll insert the coupon database names here, hip to save or southernsavers.com, and you type in what you're looking for. Um, and then if there's a coupon for it, if it, pop, it will pop up, whether it's digital, printable, or in the inserts, okay? So the biggest takeaway from this is look at your ad, look at your inserts, match them up, save a lot of money. If you wanna see this in action, I have videos on my channel, Target, I have Walmart, I have Dollar General, I have Dollar Tree. Did you know you can use coupons at Dollar Tree? Talk about free food and non-perishables at Dollar Tree. You have to check the size restrictions because some coupons like we saw in our Kellogg cereal have um, size restrictions where you, it has to be a certain size. Um, some things don't have size restrictions so you can go ham. Um, but anyways, the videos I have, Dollar Tree, Dollar General, CBS, Walgreens, Target, Walmart, Publix. I'm couponing at all these places. And you will literally see me. What I did was to get to get to the printable breakdown. I looked at the ad. I looked at the insert preview. I looked at the inserts. I was like, oh, Colgate's on sale at CVS. We're going to get a $1 Colgate coupon. CVS is going to give us a $2.50 coupon. That makes it free. We must do this deal. Literally, that's what I did. So if you have a stop and shop, if you have a shoppers, you have a Safeway. Oh, I used to like doing Safeway Giant. 
Um, Kroger's. Oh, man, I wish I could shop at Kroger's. Um, they have some amazing deals and they have some stuff that's free. But the nearest Kroger is like 200 miles away, right? Look at the ad. Look at the inserts. Use your coupon database and find the best deal for you. There's a lot of videos coming in the future. I really just want to help you all save money. I hope this video was informative. It's very basic. It's very minimal. Um, but it will save you so much money. Get the ad. Look at the inserts match up the deals that is the couponing secret right some stores give you extra savings some stores have fantastic store coupons like cvs and target that give you a more opportunity to save more money some stores are basic like walmart where it's just it's on sale for two dollars use a one dollar coupon it's a one dollar out of pocket Walmart doesn't really give you back gift cards. Target gives you back gift cards. CVS gives you back extra bucks. Walgreens gives you points or register rewards for certain items. Um, so, I hope this video was informative. I know I probably said this a lot. I know I'm rambling, I'm raving. Go. I know I'm rambling and raving, um, but I really just want to help you all. Thank you all so much for the love and support. I really appreciate it. And so does Kinsley. She loves to record with me. Um, we really appreciate the love and support. If you have any questions, please comment down below. If you have any ideas of more things you want to learn as a beginner, please comment that also down below. Um, I'm creating my content um, for early next year so that I can give you guys great videos. But stay tuned. We're going to have videos on all the rebate apps that I use and all the stores that I shop on. I'm going to have a video dedicated to each one. Um, as always, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.